Hey guys, it's Madam Wario. Welcome back to more Let's Play Wii Sports. We are bowling for the second time. And this time we've actually got an audience that we can tell who the people are. As you can see in the me's behind me. Or maybe you can't, but regardless, they're my me's. So I'm pretty excited about it. So what I thought we would do today is... I think we'll bowl once. We'll just do one game of bowling. And then what we'll do after that is... Um, the little bowling exercises I talked about in the last bowling episode that um, I talked about how there's these exercises where there are like a hundred pins and it's really cool to watch I don't know that that is unlocked in this particular mode yet or this particular game because this is on my you know stripped Wii instead of my <laughs> it sounded really wrong but my stripped Wii instead of my Wii U where everything was transferred so might have to start from the beginning and do a different exercise first but regardless it shouldn't be anything that you guys will like you know hate watching or you know anything like that I'm sure it will still be entertaining you know something I do like about bowling on this game is how it is pretty quick paced it's pretty fast paced unlike the real thing where it's like Someone has to score, and it takes forever for your turn to come around. Probably because you're only doing turn after turn after turn in Wii Sports. Unlike in real life, which would, like, make it not as much fun. But still, regardless, it's kind of like, well, this way we can be a pimp and party and have a good time. Just pretty quickly, actually. So, but yeah, bowling doesn't ever take much time in this game, which is nice. Okay, cool. I want to hit those last two. Let's work. Oh, that was stupid. We could have done better than that. See, like, we're already halfway through this. Which is nice, because then you can get really good at it really fast, because you're able to play more games in a shorter amount of time. Anyway, though, enough of talking about that. And... Last time I complained about how my thumb is like short and fat and stuff. So this time, what am I going to complain about? I don't know. I don't have any complaints. Do I have a rant? Maybe. Yeah, like it's kind of weird. Not much is really happening. Not anything new really is happening in the gaming world. Just saying. Like, I mean, everything's kind of in a lull. Like, some things were just announced, and that's cool, but it's like little not so overly fantastic things. They're just like, the 2DS was recently announced, and a lot of people have been asking for my thoughts and opinions on the matter, which I will explain in a second, but regardless of that, there hasn't really been, like, uh, yeah, like, there haven't been very many big releases recently. I mean, like, I feel like Animal Crossing was the last big one. Unless I'm, like, totally overlooking something in, you know, a genre that I don't really follow. But I don't think I am. I just feel like we've been at this lull period. Because now it's like when Nintendo, along with every other gaming company, decides that they're going to hold everything back until the holidays. Which is fine, because more people are buying than anyway. And everybody's busy this time of year with school and everything else in life starting back up again. And so, you know. But, wow, it's already over. Holy crap. Jesus, that didn't take much time at all. Well, we'll go ahead and go to these exercises, because I think they'll be more amusing than just watching another game. And then I can talk about um, how or my thoughts on the 2DS, which a lot of people thought was a joke, which is kind of funny. But anyway, picking up spares, knock down the pin. Yeah, we have to start at the beginning, so this will be fine. So anyway, um, something I wanted to, <laughs> whoa, okay. Uh, something I wanted to talk about with that is I actually think it looks really, really cute. If any of you guys follow me on Twitter, nice you probably saw the, oh my god, it looks so cute, because it just does to me. It's like this little square, like, old school-esque nice game throw. system. Like, it reminds me of a, like, fat Game Boy, which 
sounds funny, but I'm serious. And like it's really thin and lighter than the original 3DS, which obviously it's not 3DS because it just plays like a regular nice. DS. Um, but calling it that would cause confusion, so I understand the title 2DS, it just sounds kind of funny. Um, knowing that the 3DS existed nice first. <laughs> so, you know, there was no like, it was DS and then all this other, all these other DS spin-off names. There was no like DS1 and then 3DS, just, what? Screw you, dude. Fine, I'll see if you miss this crap. But anyway, I think it's actually really great because, um, honestly, I don't, I love the 3D feature. Like, I love having the option, especially because I'm such a graphics buff and nerd. But what I will say is it's not really necessary. I mean, the games are good enough alone as, like, standalone games. You know, 3D aside, it's not like, wow, 3D really makes this game, you know, great. It's like, no, the game is already awesome. Like, you don't nice even need the 3D. Um, but anyway, that being said, like, so I don't really play in 3D that much. I will, like, I'll play Kid Icarus in 3D, and I'll play um, Fire Emblem in 3D, but not all the time. I mean, even that, like, my eyes will get tired, or I'll just, and Paper Mario too. I will play that in 3D, but, you know, your eyes will get tired, or it'll wear your battery out so fast that you just turn it off. And so the 2DS, for how much cheaper it is, because it's, like, almost $100 cheaper, isn't it? It's quite a bit cheaper anyway. For what it is, it's great because I think it's just, it really allows like maybe kids who have never had a game system before but really want one and their parents are going, no, I'm not spending, you know, $250 on a game system. That's ridiculous. You know, it it's helping those parents or kids who, families that don't have nice as much money to spend on their kids like that, just like gifts and stuff. or. You know, families that have a lot of kids where not everybody can get a freaking, nice you know, $400 gift at Christmas time or whatever. It's really great for that. Like, that is just fantastic. So I'm really glad that um, Nintendo is offering something like the 2DS. And I really think that's respectable. Whoa, bronze, because I went through 11 lanes. Cool. Okay, so anyway, um, second one is unlocked, so I guess I'll go ahead and, aha, this is it, yes, power throws, we're gonna knock down as many pins as possible. Now I am gonna do this again in another week where, it's probably gonna be next week actually, where we just look at all the training mode things, cause they are pretty funny and interesting sometimes. This will definitely be on there again, but I just think it's so amusing, just regardless, we can afford to see it twice, I swear. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna go with that. I really do love playing Wii Sports at this time of year. It's just a great time of year for it, just because it's, it reminds me so much of when I first got my Wii, which I explained already, that's why I'm doing the project now. It's just like, yes. Nice throw. nice throw. Just love how enthusiastic this guy is all the time. Nice throw. Oh, bummer. You didn't get it. Mmm. We'll try the angled throw. Oh, sometimes that works even better. Boom. Oh, man. One. So lame. So lame. Yeah. See, that doesn't work as well in these stages, just going straight forward. You almost have to angle it. Let's try it from over here and see how that works. And yeah, that worked pretty well, I will say that much. One pin left. See, I just love how many pins there are. Oh man, and this isn't even the mode I was talking about. The mode I'm talking about is the third one. Which is just like this, except it's not like all about strike. I think you just start out with more pins anyway. I think. Unless I am getting mixed up. Or no, the third one might be like strategic throws. I can't remember. We'll find out after this regardless. But this is just my favorite anyway. These 
big mass amounts of pins. It takes so long to set that up, like, because I don't know if machines exist who would set up that many pins at once. Oh, that'd be so awesome though. Oh man, bronze again. Power throws. Yeah, let's see what the third one is. Okay. This is... Oh yeah, it's like... It is like strategic throws, like avoiding barriers and stuff. Well, I'll go ahead and save that one for when we actually just go through all the training stuff anyway, so that way we'll have one surprise at the end. But yeah, that's going to conclude today's episode, so I hope you've enjoyed my sweet talk about the 2DS. This has been Madame Wario. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.